Working people were struggling to make it long before the pandemic arrived. Big corporations and the very wealthy were doing very well before the pandemic. That's why I've said, starting back in my campaign for president, that it's not enough to just build back. We have to build back better than before. And that's how it all begins. Big corporations and super wealthy have to start paying their fair share of taxes. It's long overdue. I'm not out to punish anyone. I'm a capitalist. If you can make a million or a billion dollars, that's great. God bless you. All I'm asking is you pay your fair share. Pay your fair share. Just like middle class folks do. But that isn't happening now. Today in this country right now, the top 1%, for example, evade an estimated $160 billion in taxes that they owe each year. Not new taxes, taxes that they owe. And the way it works is this. If you're a typical American, like I suspect most of the press people sitting in front of me here, you pay your taxes. Why? Because you get a W-2 form. It comes in the mail every year. The IRS gets that information as well. Your taxes get deducted from your paycheck, and you pay what is owed beyond that. That's why 99% of working people pay the taxes they owe. But that's not how it works for people with tens of millions of dollars. They play by a different set of rules, and they're often not employees themselves. So the IRS can't see what they make and can't tell if they're cheating. That's how many of the top 1% get away with paying virtually nothing. It's estimated by serious economists that that number is about $160 billion collectively owed each year that doesn't get paid. It's not an even playing field. My plan would help solve that. For example, it would give the IRS the resources it needs to keep up with the lawyers and accountants and the super of the super wealthy. It would ask just for two pieces of information from the banks of these folks that amounts, the amounts that come into their bank accounts and what amounts <clears throat> go out of their bank accounts so that the wealthy can no longer hide what they're making and they can finally begin to pay their fair share of what they owe. <clears throat> that isn't about raising their taxes. It's about the super wealthy finally beginning to pay what they owe.